And this year, we're seeing double-digit increases again. I mean, GLP-1s haven't been around that long. You know, I was thinking about this, and it feels like they've been around forever when I think of it, but a lot of this information came out or started coming out in 2023. And before that, these weren't really even on the market. So these are newer medications. We're just starting to learn about them. We're just starting to learn how popular they are. We're looking at the trend increases in these medications over time and the cost increases, and also what health plans and insurance companies are doing to manage costs. Obviously costs have gone up year over year, and this year we're seeing double digit increases again. And what I'm hearing in the market from underwriters and actuaries is that a lot of these increases are delayed. 